Ladies and gentlemen, today we are back on Black Ops 4, the beta, and today I want to be showing you the best gun that is in the game, or best SMG. At the moment, in this first beta, the MX-9, which is the first SMG that you actually unlock, basically just looks like a vector. Actual gameplay right now in S&D, in which in this s and I think it go 10 and 1, I believe. The gameplay of this s and game was insane. I would say the best s and SMG gameplay that I've had personally myself up until now, I went off with this gun in s and Now, I'm actually going to be showing you the loadout right Right over here right now so I've got my MX-9 level 12 what you want to do is you want to unlock tritium site which is like kind of a red dot site uh, but they've named it something else just to make it look a bit more elegant and that is the same site that I'm running the gameplay that you are seeing right now you don't want to really run the reflex site it's a bit too large and the holographic site is a bit too large you don't really want them sites if you unlock this first site you don't want to run it just run the stock site don't run a site until you unlock the tritium site that's my own opinion next you're gonna have is the AP rounds on this gun so as you can see, it destroys enemy armor, increases damage to equipment and vehicles. The armor that people have is what this is, the body armor. Now, I'm actually going to stick that on to my SMG class right now. That's something that I haven't stuck on. You get like a bit of extra health onto it. And you really notice it when you go against enemies because it kind of makes it a bit more difficult. And the time to kill in this game is a bit more difficult as well. It's a bit, people have a bit more health and you have a bit more health. So that just helps you have a tiny bit more health upgraded onto that. So that's why the AP rounds usually come into health because, you know, most people will be running body armor in the game. Game. And then last, not least, uh, attachment you want to have on X9 is stock. So you move faster while aiming. Most of you guys will know in Call of Duty that you want to really kind of have this on assault rifles, but I find it easier to really have this on SMGs as well, definitely in this game, because hip fire is quite bad and you can't drop shot. This really helps making sure that you aim down the site while moving quickly. So I rarely ever use the pistol and you guys will probably find yourself not really using the pistols unless you're running a sniper and then a pistol, then fair enough, you probably will be switching to a pistol to get those close range kills. But I'm going to actually alter this class right now, as I'm speaking right now and doing this video, because I realized I'm not actually using the pistol that much. You have up to 10 class-like things that you can use, uh, so I can't use a pistol now because I've literally used that many attachments for my first gun. So you want to have primary gunfighter on there, and then equipment, you can have, uh, actually I can't stick our combat axe on because I'm on my max stuff. You don't really need a special issue stuff, you rarely use a trophy system to be honest in this game, but if you're playing domination, you probably want to use that risk one attachment down. But body armor, I would say is like essential, most people are running it inside the game, and it is kind of vital to have in the game as well. You want to make sure you don't die. Now onto the perks right here, and the last thing on this SMG class is cold blooded that I have for the perk one. So increased resistance to enemy ability, equipment, and score streak targeting systems so basically i might actually stick on tactical mask right now yeah i'm gonna stick on tactical mask because i think i get hit more with those nine banks concussions uh, razor wire and all those that are listed there perk two we're gonna go for is lightweight now this was actually just the preset one but i'm gonna actually have a look on here scavenger you don't really need you can pick up guns along the way move faster while sprinting and take no damage when falling uh, definitely want to sprint faster if you're using an smg make sure you get across the map and get all those kills quickly run across the map but i think lightweight will be more beneficial Perk number three we're gonna go for is Ghost. Now I literally run this perk on every single class. I'm not, I'm not even gonna show you guys, but I literally run this perk on every single class because it says undetectable and by enemy UAVs while moving. Now that's actually a good thing that Call of Duty have done. So, but if you're camping, then you will be seen. So that's kind of good. It eliminates those campers. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys do enjoy this best SMG class video. This gun is literally the best gun in the game. Everybody is saying it is the best gun, and it really is. If you want some proof watch this gameplay that i'm gonna finish off with and i'll see you guys in the next video hope you guys did enjoy this video let me know if you guys want to see more videos like this uh drop them in the comments below and tell me about blackout and black ops 4 what you think of it and i'll see you guys in the next video make sure you subscribe turn those notifications on see you guys in the next video cheers Body.